What's up, y'all? Bring you guys another video. Vincent Fagenboots versus Nuhu Lawal. Who do y'all think is gonna win this fight? Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video. It helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So to those who doesn't know, this fight is set to take place on the 19th of June, June 19, 2021 over in Hamburg, Germany. This fight is uh, its honestly a stay busy fight for Vincent Fagenbutz. Because if you guys don't know, Fagenbutz is basically already set to fight Felix Sturm in the future. So, uh, yeah, and by the way, Felix Sturm will be fighting in this card as well. So, it's a stay busy fight for Vincent Fagenbutz. To those who doesn't know who Fagenbutz is, he's a 25-year-old fighter from Germany. 32-3, and 3, 28 wins coming by way of Nakar TKO. You've probably seen him in there against the likes of Caleb Plant and uh, Giovanni Di Carolis. Um, and yeah, and he lost also his, one of his early fights. But, but yeah, he's, uh, you know, he's, I would say, a... a Hop contender. I would say he's higher than European level in my opinion. I think Vincent Fagenbutz is, is, you know, he can definitely beat a lot of the top European level fighters. But in the world level, um, he's not there yet. But he's 25 years old, so he'll continue to improve, uh, you know, as the years go by. I think by, you know, in my opinion, you're you're in your prime around your late 20s or at the age of 30. Around 30, basically, you're in your prime. So Fagenbutz is still learning and improving fight after fight. His opponent this coming uh, June 19 is going to be against Nuhu Lawal, who is a 39-year-old fighter from Germany as well, originally from Nigeria. 27 wins, 8 losses, 15 wins coming by way of Nakari TKO. He is currently in a 3-fight losing streak, losing to Evgeny Shevchenko, Eidos Yerbosunuli, Denis Radovan, and uh, yeah, actually he's lost a lot of fights. The past 10 fights, jeez. Yes, yes, yes. Basically, it looks like whenever he fought somebody decent, he ends up losing. He got knocked out by Mikhail Soro, lost to Martin Murray, lost to Artem Japotrev. My goodness, he's lost so many fights. So you know how this fight will play out. Basically, the, the script is Lawal is supposed to lose. 39 years old, his cannon father at this point. He's somebody that they hire so that Fagan Boots can win and look good in. Fagan Boots, if he loses his fight, if Fagan Boots loses his fight, he should just retire. There's no point of continuing if he loses if he, he loses his fight. He should be able to go out there and have no problem uh, showing his huge speed power against uh, Nuhu Lawal. And, you know, if, if Lawal somehow pulls this off, you know, good job. But, it, yeah, that means Fagan Boots' career is not going anywhere if he loses his fight. Plus, like I said, he has to win this fight if he wants that big fight against Felix Sturm. In my opinion, I think this will be a huge fight over in Germany. So, so yeah, it's a must-win fight for Vincent, Vincent Fagenboots. So, in the end, I'm picking Fagenboots, Fagenboots to win this fight by TKO knockout, whether it's in the middle, middle rounds, uh, early rounds, or late rounds. Even if it goes a distance, uh, I think Fagenboots should be able to win this fight. Uh, I'll be shocked. It will be definitely one of the biggest upsets of the year if uh, Fagenboots somehow loses this fight to Lawal. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. All right. Thanks.